Welcome everyone to the very first installment of the Backpacking Challenge, which is a collaboration with Safi's Plays and Spacey Sims and myself. I will have a link to each of their channels in the description down below for each of these episodes so that you can check on their progress along with checking up on our progress. The rules for the Backpacking Challenge are also in the description down below. And the nuts and bolts of it is we start off with an empty uh, plot of land. We get 2,000 simoleons for just the bare necessities. So we do have a tent and we do have a cooler and we have a camera. And we cannot return to this plot of land until the end of the challenge. The challenge really consists of them taking a backpacking trip to Windenburg visiting each of the neighborhoods at least once, visiting each of the venues at least once, and we can't duplicate visits. So once you visit one place, you can't visit it again. And you're allowed to stay on that plot of land till 10 a.m. sim time. And then you have to scoot your boot to another place. So <laughs> it's going to be really interesting with these characters, which is a great segue into introducing the cast of the Backpacking Challenge. And of course, the backstory is that they just graduated high school and they got gifted the trip to Windenburg, the backpacking trip to Windenburg. So without further ado, this is Miss Spacey Sims caricature. Uh, his name is Kevin Spacey and he is a perv. <laughs> for lack of a better word. He is going to Windenburg to meet the ladies. So he's going to be a fun character. Some more personality traits for Mr. Spacey is that he is a geek. He is squeamish, which will be so much fun. And he is an insider, which is one of the new traits uh, from Get Together. Miss Safi Z. This is Safi's plays caricature, her sim. And she is outgoing and romantic. She's a bit of a flirt, super clumsy, and she wants to be a friend to the world. So she's going to be super friendly. We're going to have to keep her out of trouble with the fellas. And my sim, Lee Virtual, which I just noticed this, I gave her a little bit too much junk in the trunk. Yes, I did. <laughs> well, it's all about that base, about that base. No treble. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just, I just realized that I got a little crazy with the bum, hun. That's all right. You got a little bit of junk in the trunk. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Meet Lee Virtual. She is my sim and she is clumsy as well but she loves the outdoors she's our painter she's going to go to art school after this backpacking challenge if she survives it and she is super creative so that is our cast and crew for this challenge and i am going to pause the video here because i want you to see day one's travel and what happened to them at their very first venue so i'll see you on the flip side so before I show you what actually happened on their trip to Windenburg, I forgot one of the most important steps to this challenge, which is setting up a backpacking club with this crew. So we're going to do that together. We're going to, can I create a club here? We're going to create a club and we're going to call this club dirty and flirty because I have a feeling they're going to be so filthy without having showers <laughs> readily available and uh, we're going to call this the backpacking trip that allows you to roast marshmallows and also cop a feel. <laughs> It's going to be um, invite only because we're going to, as we meet people that we want to include in our backpacking um, group throughout our time in Windenburg, we can actually extend an invitation and have them join us at any venue at that point. Um, so the requirement is, yeah, let's do that. So hang out by fire, use the platform, grill, 
be romantic with everyone and woohoo with everyone. <laughs> and then I I think we decided that we shouldn't um, really exclude any behaviors because I don't know. I'm just going to leave it the exclusions out for now. Um, club hangout, none. And dirty and flirty is complete for now. Oh, we need a symbol. <laughs> um, maybe the fire would be a good one. I wish we can mesh them. I wish we can have lips and fire. Dirty and flirty club has been created. All right, now for reals. I'll see you guys on the flip side. Dear Diary, OMG, imagine our excitement to touch land in Windenburg. The air smelled of blooming lilacs and powdered sugar. Oh my gosh, it was spectacular. Kev suggested we make the bluffs our first stop, and we all agreed. I swear, Diary, the bluff is a place between heaven and earth. My jaw hit the gravel path before we even had a chance to tour the location. So happy Kev suggested it. A few minutes later, Steve, Safi, and I took turns playing Truth or Dare. Don't ask me how, but we ended up skinny dipping, and while we weren't looking, someone stole our clothes. You heard me right. Us equals no clothes. So we ended up spending the entire day like we were part of a sick rerun of Naked and Afraid. Except we only had our tent camera and cooler left. What did we do, you asked, Diary? Well, I'm glad you asked. Absolutely nothing. That day, we just walked around as naked as the day we were born. It was actually quite liberating. Okay, so that happened. They're going to have to be but naked for the entire episode until they figure out what to do with their clothes. Nothing like sitting your bum on a cold cooler. Said nobody ever. Look how pretty that is. I feel like these teens are just in a point in life where they're coming out from being micromanaged all their life to tasting freedom for the first time before college. I hate the pixelization because I can't really tell what they do when their hands are in the pixelated areas, which, awkward. <laughs> Maybe we don't want to know what they're doing. Like right now, Kevin's picking his butt crack. <laughs> I don't know. Something's happening with their butt crack. <laughs> awkward naked dance. <laughs> Uh, all right. <laughs> Go, Kevin. Go, Kevin. In your birthday suit. Yes, really. <laughs> Go, Safi. <laughs> Anything you can do, I can do better. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's like shock and awe that they're butt naked. Oh, Lee, are you glitched out in the fertilizing bush? She's been fertilizing forever. That is one serious number two you're doing there, Lee. I'll just leave you to your business. <gasps> is she going to woohoo in bush with Safi? Look. Safi, you sneaky, sneaky thing. Oh, I don't know if she. <gasps> Safi, <gasps> first woohoo of the. Oh, she's embarrassed. This whole entire episode was their friends getting scandalized by the fact that they're nude. And honestly, the storyline says they can't help it. Their clothes were stolen. So they're just going to have to deal with it. Ollie, you're so exhausted. And you're going to be dirty soon. Oh, no. <laughs> what is she doing? Is she farting in the fire? <laughs> 
And they're like, oh, woo, I think she did fart. This one blonde keeps farting and <laughs> they're taking turns passing gas. Look at her. Rip. <laughs> it's the weirdest interaction with the fire. I'm sure they're just warming their bum, but there he goes. Rip. <laughs> and now she's belching. Burp. Rip. Burp. Rip. <laughs> the Rip and Burp Choir. <laughs> <clears throat> well, it's official. Each and every one of our Sims stink like holy heck. The Green Mile confirms it. <laughs> She's so disgusted with herself right now. <laughs> Aw, Safi. I'm sorry, Boo. Aw, her lip is trembling. And qu <laughs> oh, this is going to be terrible for them. So this installment is going to be put up every Monday on my channel. Uh, do check out Safi's Plays and Spacey Sims channel for their updates on their first day in Windenburg on their backpacking challenge. Um, it should prove to be a really interesting dynamic. We're already seeing, well, there were some glitches in this particular um, venue that were not any fun but we are hoping that those glitches will go away in the next chapter. So again, every Monday I will be uploading the backpacking challenge with Lee, Kevin, and Safi and their amazing adventures in Windenburg. They're gonna be dirty for sure. Their group name was perfect. They're dirty and flirty <laughs> for real. I appreciate you spending the last few minutes with me. Until next time, you guys take care and I'll talk to you soon. Ciao.